Hello everyone. This video I will show how to use this dashboard width drop down menu, and this project I build by using Java Swing with flat laugh look and feel, so you can change theme light and dark mode and custom more color and style. And I am sorry, I cannot explain all the source code that I have right, because it alone of code so it's difficult to make you to understand, but don't worry, I will show how to use this dashboard and I show some example in this video, and as you don't understand let comment below, I will try to answer as soon as possible. Here the project that I have created NetBean IDE, and for the source code this project, let check the link I put in description this video. For the library has use in this project, I use FlatLaugh for look and feel, flat extras, and SVG Salamander for create SVG icon. And here class application.java is the main J from class, in this J from we do not design anything. But in this class we create the main form as the public static, and this main form contain a drop down menu and panel body to display each panel form, for this main form class I will show you next. And here initialize the main form, and set it to the JFRAM by using method set content pane, so it will deploy full of the JFRAM, so why we do this, because when we want to change the whole form of the application, like login form, so after user login we change the whole form to the main form, but in this project not have login form, but I will add it next video, so I have to come to modify in this class later. And here the flat laugh register custom default source, to load the flat laugh custom property, so the property file we put in this package, for this property I will explain next. And here we set up the look and feel by default I use flat dark yellow laugh, but if you want to change it to light mode when the application start, you can change it to flat IntelliJ laugh. So here the main form class. Now scroll down we see here the menu class, panel body and menu button that have create in this main form. Here is the menu. And here the button menu. And this is the panel body to display each panel form when user click on the menu item. And here the default form, that I have create for example to show when user click on menu. Here my logo that show on menu header. And this SVG icon for menu button left and right. And here the menu class, this is important you need to know. Here the menu and submenu item so you can change here, for this sample the dashboard menu do not have any submenu, and email menu have submenu inbox, red and compost. And for the menu icon we set it in package menu.icon. So the name of the icon if follow by index of the menu, and we use the SVG file icon, so this icon as 0.svg it will be the icon of dashboard menu item. And we do not use the icon for the submenu item. Here the header name, you can change here. And this for the menu maximum and minimum width, this will apply when user click on menu button. And this header full gap from horizontal header gap when the menu is maximum. It mean the header menu space. And here the header icon you can set here or copy replace my logo in this package. And here for the light dark mode class, used to change the theme mode. And here the flat laugh custom property file, we use three property, flat dark laugh for dark theme, flat laugh for both dark and light, and flat light laugh for light theme, so when the application change on dark mode the flat laugh automatic load the dark property, and if the application change to light mode the flat laugh automatic load the light property, 
and for the flat laugh dot properties we use both light mode and dark mode. So the is the awesome flat laugh look and feel build it, and you can easy to custom and control the color and component style. So now I will show how to display the panel form when user click on the menu item. Here when user click on this submenu it will display the inbox form. So we need to create new panel form or we can copy from this default form. After create new form, now go to class main form, and in method init menu event, we need modify this event here. And for display form, we call application.mainform.showForm, then pass the component you want to display, and this code you can call from anywhere, because we have assigned the main form as public static instance. So in this event we have two argument, index and subindex, so we can use it to know what is menu index have selected. And here we see the form inbox has display on the main body, so now I show you create one more form as red form. So we can copy from form inbox. And you can design what you want and what you need, for this form I just create from the example. For the next video I will create a login form, and design form input data by using FlatLaf custom property to make a beautiful UI for this project. And thank you everyone for watching. See you next video.